What's going on, guys? It's CJ, and if you're like me, making money on YouTube, and you get paid from Google AdSense, for some reason this month, you have not received pay. I'm gonna to explain to you why you have not received the Google payment, okay? Let me show you my Google Studio analytics, and we'll understand what's going on exactly. So, hold on, pay attention. Here on your YouTube homepage, you're gonna to go to YouTube Studio, okay? Once you go there, you're gonna jump down to analytics on the left, click on revenue. Okay, scroll down, look at your payments. Look and see how much money you've been receiving for each month. Okay, I first became monetized in February. I received $890, 650 March, 273 in April. Okay, now something happens in May. I received 91 but I didn't actually receive that money. That's because there's a threshold. The threshold is $100. So what happens when you don't meet the $100 threshold? You have to wait until your earnings from last month equal $100 with your new month's earnings. So I received $91.94 in May. Then in June, I received $67.10. That is past $100. It was $159 and that means it's payout time. So I didn't receive a payment in June. I received May's payment in July. Now for July, so far I've only received 7130. So that means if I don't hit $100 by the end of July, I'm going to miss another payment for August. So let me show you my Google AdSense email. We sent you a payment, Google AdSense, July 21st. Okay, I was paid yesterday, July 21st, which was a Tuesday. Now, Google AdSense only pays on the 21st of each month or the next business day if it falls on a weekend and a holiday. I didn't put that in there, but if it's a weekend or holiday, they will pay you in the next business day. So for last month in June, even though I didn't get paid, the 21st was on a Sunday which means everyone on YouTube was paid on the 22nd, whoever was receiving payments. Now, let me show you the next picture here, which is 159, okay? And let's go back. Pull out the calculator, 9194 plus 6710, 159.04. Okay, so that's what I got paid for May's earnings combined with June because I didn't hit the $100 threshold. I was pretty close, but I didn't hit it. And so I had to wait another month. So 159.04. Okay, so now there's another thing I wanna show you regarding the AdSense. This is located in the Google AdSense. You can go down to settings, manage settings, and you can actually change your payment schedule. You're gonna click on the little pencil, and as it says, 100 threshold. Now you can't change it to a lower amount, but you can change it to a higher amount. So if you're interested in saving money, getting paid at a larger amount at, a, at another date, you can do that as well. You can change the threshold payout amount, and you can change the payout date up to one year, it says. All right, now let me go and show you Payment timelines, according to Google and AdSense right here, as I said, if your balance exceeds the payment threshold and you have no payment holds, you'll be issued a payment between the 21st and the 26th of the month. Note the exact time you receive your payment will depend on your time zone, whether the 21st falls on a weekend or holiday and your chosen form of payment. Okay, so you have essentially six days to receive payment from Google AdSense starting on the 21st. Between the 21st and the 26th, you will receive a payment. If you didn't receive it, it's because you didn't make a minimum of $100 for the month or there's some other reason you have a different form of payment, maybe your bank account, whatever kind of form of payment you're waiting on is holding up the transaction, okay? 
Also, it says if a publisher's account is found to be in violation of terms and conditions or policies, we may at any time withhold payment beginning from the Google Initiates investigation of policy violations, deduct earnings from the publisher's account, and or refund advertisers for clicks received on publisher's site or AdSense results page. So if you don't make any money on YouTube and you want to know how, first you need to be in the YouTube Partner Program. How do you get into that? You need to follow all YouTube monetization policies, which is the community guidelines, terms of service, copyright, and Google AdSense policies. You have to live in a country where YouTube Partner Program is available. You have to have 4,000 valid public watch hours in the last 12 months, have 1,000 subscribers, and have a linked Google AdSense account. Set up a Google AdSense account. You can only have one AdSense account. Google.com slash AdSense slash start is the website to sign in or get started creating a Google AdSense account. So how do you get money from YouTube? You get it through ads, you get it through super chats, meaning people send you money or super chats or super stickers when you're live streaming or you premiere the video or you have memberships on your account and you're getting paid memberships every month from your subscribers who are memberships. YouTube takes 30% of all earnings. Keep that in mind. Another thing that I want to talk to you about is how much money should you save every month since YouTube is not taking the taxes out of your earnings, how much money should you save set aside for when you do file your 1099 taxes? You should expect to put aside 30 to 35% of your income. So what I do every time I get paid on the 21st or whatever day it is of the month, I put aside 30% of my pay and I sit it aside into a savings account to let it accrue some interest, but I have that money ready to go for when I need to pay my 1099 taxes. So there you go, guys. I hope that helped you out. Keep track of all your earnings on the YouTube studio and Google AdSense. Make sure everything is correct. Your accounts are valid. You're not violating any terms of service, and you guys should be good to go. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Thanks, guys.